The number two ranked Baylor women's basketball team season ended with a disappointing upset by Oregon State in the Sweet 16, leaving the Bears 33-2 overall. Let's take a quick look back at their season. Winning 30 games in a row, the Lady Bears took home the Big 12 regular season and conference tournament championship for the ninth season, but it wasn't easy. There were plenty of hurdles to overcome. It started in November with the death of my grandchild. Then it was um, Trinity Oliver tore her knee up. We only had 10 to begin with. Trinity Oliver tore her knee up. Then we're on the stranded on the side of a highway with fog and bus on fire, three o'clock in the morning. Then we come back and uh, Shamika dies. And it was just something that we had to deal with. And you have to deal with it. You're human. And I'm so proud of how they dealt with it um, because they really made coming to work enjoyable. And then you had Cox with the chioacidosis. Didn't even play in the UCLA game. She's trying not to go into a coma because of her diabetes. Then we find out her sister has diabetes. We have to deal with that. Then we have two families going through marital issues. It's stuff that I, I don't have a book to go, what page do I find how to deal with this on? You just deal with it from your heart. Despite all these hardships, the Lady Bears stood together strong and silenced the skeptics, proving they could still compete at a championship level with only eight players. I think we fought hard. I think we fought till the end, and that's all I could really ask for. And I know that we all wanted it the same way I wanted it, even though I'm a senior. But, you know, we fell a little short, but I'm proud of our overall season. Seniors Christy Wallace and Akia Cohen will be graduating this May, but we'll be seeing Kalani Brown, Lauren Cox, Natalie Cho, Juicy Landrum, Dee Dee Richards, Trinity Oliver, Moon Urson, Alexis Morris, and a number one recruiting class on the court next spring. Reporting on the Lady Bears for the last time this season, here in Lexington, Kentucky, inside Rupp Arena, I'm Elizabeth Tharp for Lariat TV News.